How do we bisect angle ABC? This angle measures something and we just have to divide that measure into two equal parts. That's what bisecting means. To bisect an angle, the first thing that we need is a compass. We keep the compass on the vertex of the angle and set it to any convenient width. Remember, this width can be of any length. With this width, we need to draw an arc across each leg of the angle. An arc across the first and one across the second. We have two intersections here. Intersection of the first arc with this leg and that of the second arc with this leg. We keep the compass on any one of these intersections. Let's say we keep it here. With the compass here, we have to make an arc anywhere in the interior of the angle. Anywhere in this region. Let's make an arc here. Now we need to be a bit careful. We should not change the width of the compass. We need this width to draw another arc. And for the other arc, we keep the compass on the intersection at the other leg. We keep the compass here and with the width unchanged, we draw an arc to intersect the previous arc. So now we get a point where the two arcs intersect. To get the angle bisector, all we need to do is join these two points. So we draw a straight line from point B to the intersection of the arcs. These two angles will be equal. Remember, the arms of the angle and the angle bisector are rays. They start from a point and go indefinitely in one direction. If we mark a point D here, we can say that ray BD is the angle bisector of angle ABC and angle ABD will equal angle DBC.